everybody, it's Rosie and welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I will be incorporating Dollar General hygiene products into my morning hygiene routine. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are not already. And let's get into it. So in this bag here, I have a variety of hygiene products like mouthwash, shaving cream, exfoliating body wash, and a few other things. So I'm just gonna go through my morning, use all of these products, and then we're gonna come back here at the end and rate and review each and every one of them. So without further ado, let's get to it. to use the earth supplied mango butter body cream with aloe vera and vitamin D. Oh, just like look at that look at how rich like oh my goodness alrighty so there are still two products that I haven't tested so I'm gonna send you on over to Rosie of the future so she can test those products with you guys right now all right see you in a minute Hello, this is Rosie 1.0 from the future, and I just used the Vanilla Body Fantasies Fragrance Body Spray. Um, that's a lie. I used it about four hours ago, and I am still smelling like vanilla. It's amazing. I'm going to give this five out of five stars because, like, the scent has just stuck to me, unlike any other perfume or body mist that I have used. Like I still smell like relatively strongly of vanilla. This was only $1 as opposed to like the 15 or the 14.50 that you would pay at Bath and Body Works. So five out of five stars, 10 out of 10 recommend. Hey, it is Rosie 2.0 from the future and we are going to apply the Marble Anti-Stress Peel Off Mask. So Ugh, okay. Here we are. Um, yeah, I'll see you when it's time to peel. <laughs> I think that I'm gonna have to wash the rest of it off because it still is uh, pretty wet and it's not like peeling off like it should. So I will be right back. Alrighty, so I have washed it off my face and I'm, I'm really red because I had to, to scrub it off. Um, but yes, this is my baby. This is Simba. Say hello. <gasps> Yes, see hello. So I'm going to give the Marble Peel Off Mask a 4 out of 10. It was only $1.40 and it peeled off really nicely. It dried down good. I did put a really thick layer on my cheek, so that was my bad. And I just didn't let it dry out all the way before I tried to peel it off. Um, but I wasn't a huge fan of the fact that the colors were separate. However, um, it didn't really matter in the end. I just mixed them together. It actually was kind of pretty. <laughs> so in the end, it's going to get a four out of five stars. So the first product that we are going to review is the DG Health Antiseptic Mouthwash in the flavor Blue Mint. This was, I think, $1.25, so it was really cheap, and it's a whole 16.9 fluoride ounces or 500 milliliters. So this is gonna last actually probably like two weeks or so, so I would say that that's pretty great for the price. The flavor, it does burn a little bit, not necessarily in a bad way, kind of in the way that like, when you eat an Altoid and it kind of like burns on your gums a little bit, that's what this is like, but it wasn't anything, you know, super unreasonable, not a deal breaker by any means. So five out of five for the DG Health Antiseptic Mouthwash in the flavor of Blue Mint. The next product I used was the Hask Argan Oil Repairing Deep Conditioner Mask. So this was $2, definitely a little bit of a splurge. I wouldn't say that this is necessarily like $2 worth of product because a whole bottle of conditioner from Hask is $4 at Target. However, this smells really, really great and you can use it like two or three times before it runs out. So that's nice. You just have to make sure that you're like actively aware of how much you're using on the first go so you can stretch it a little bit longer. My hair does feel very like moisturized and just, I don't know, it doesn't feel frizzy or itchy or anything like that and it does smell good too. I am gonna give this a five out of five stars. It's easy to use 
and it smells super good as well. The soft soap coconut butter scrub with real coconut seed butter was probably the product that I was most excited about, and it was all right. So it wasn't super exfoliating. It does mark it as an exfoliating body wash, but it's like, maybe it's because I was at the top of the bottle and some of the exfoliant particles like settled to the bottom, but I really didn't get that much exfoliation from this product. Like, I don't know, it's just, it was more of a body wash than it was exfoliating. This is really, really great as a body wash. It lathered beautifully, it smelled really great, but it was not exfoliating like in the slightest. So because of that, I'm gonna give this a four out of five because the fact that it didn't exfoliate is not exactly a deal breaker for me, but this was $4 and it is pretty great, I will say. Next up, we had the Pure Silk Spa Therapy Raspberry Mist Shave Cream. This was so great. So this was $2.25 at the Dollar General and it lathered beautifully. It went on evenly and thick and luscious. And it made my like my shave went super great my legs feel super smooth and like i i love this this is great especially for the price i think at walmart you can get like a cheaper shaving cream from equate that's almost exactly the same as this um but regardless for the dollar general this is a pretty great product and i am gonna give it a five out of five stars so next up is the earth supplied mango butter body cream with aloe vera and vitamin e now I've had this on my skin for probably 10 minutes now and I don't necessarily feel the most moisturized. Like I don't feel dry, but I don't feel like I just put body cream like all over. Um, <laughs> it smells super great, I will give it that, and it is super, super thick. Initially it did leave a little bit of a white cast that does appear to have like faded out in the last few minutes. Um, but I think this would be really beneficial if I had used an oil underneath it. But by itself, I'm not really feeling it. And because of that, I am gonna give it a three out of five stars. I'm sure that I'll figure out how to use the rest of this like in a way that works for me. But just straight up putting it on my skin did pretty much nothing for me. So that's why this is getting a three out of five. But that is all I have for you guys today. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel if you are not already. And comment down below what bargain hygiene haul you wanna see next. There are so many stores like the Five Below, the Dollar Tree, Family Dollar that I could go into and try to put together a fun, cheap hygiene routine and test it out with you guys. But like I said before, like this video, subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so, 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 so much. And I will see you in another video very, very soon because I upload every single Monday and Friday. But bye!